You ever look in the mirror one morning and go, wait a minute, was that hair gray yesterday? Yeah, welcome to the club. It's not a glitch in the matrix. It's called getting older and your hair is just the first one to snitch on you. So why does hair turn gray with age? Is it stress, karma? That one time you ate pizza off the floor? Nah, it's all about science, baby. Let's break it down. Hair gets its color from something called melanin. Melanin's like the hair's personal stylist, choosing whether you're blonde, brunette, redhead, or rockin' midnight black. It's made by special cells called melanocytes. Now here's the twist. As you age, those melanocytes, they get lazy. Like, I've been doing this job for decades, I'm out. They start producing less melanin, or they just retire completely. No melanin, no color. That's when your hair starts turning gray, silver, or full Gandalf the Wise. And before you ask, no, plucking one gray hair won't make seven more show up to its funeral. That's a myth. But hey, go ahead and keep believing it if it helps you sleep at night. Also, stress can speed things up, kinda. It doesn't cause gray hair directly, but it can mess with your body systems and possibly nudge those melanocytes into early retirement. So maybe chill out or don't. Either way, the gray's coming eventually. Genetics also play a big part. If your parents went gray early, well, congrats. You might too. Thanks, mom and dad. Some people go gray in their 20s, others in their 50s. It's not a competition. But if it was, your Uncle Dave is winning. Guy looks like a snowstorm. Bottom line? Gray hair isn't a sign you're falling apart. It's a sign you've lived. You've earned your silver stripes. Embrace it or dye it. We don't judge. So the next time you spot a gray hair, don't panic. Just nod and say, ah yes, wisdom. Even if you just spent 30 minutes looking for your sunglasses while wearing them.